welcome back to my channel so we just got an amazon package so i actually just bought these um what do you call it we just bought um some shampoo and body wash dispensers to go into our shower so i know i just want to give it a little aesthetic so so i got is that backwards anyway so it came in a three-piece set so it looks like this they're like the amber plastic bottles so i'm gonna put our body wash in there and our shampoo but before we do that i want to clean up the bathroom a little bit so y'all gonna watch me clean real quick and then we'll um switch out the do to me between me and you i feel a chemistry i won't let no one come and take your place because the love you give you can't be replaced here is our shower um this is what it looks like is it bad no could it be cuter yeah so i'm gonna go ahead and switch out um the shampoo body wash and all that and then put it into the new canisters um as you can see we don't keep much in here we're gonna keep literally the body wash and my husband's um shampoo i keep i usually keep my um shampoos and conditioners and body scrubs under my sink so that the you know so that the shower is not looking too crowded and crazy since i have the space under there so that's where i keep all my stuff so that's why we only have two things in there so i like to keep it that way all right so i'm gonna go ahead and switch out the body washes <laughs> so you can choose um, what you want to label as conditioner they have lotion hand soap dish soap and body wash <laughs>
here is what it looks like. It looks so good. All right, so I like the amber bottles. It goes with the ah, it goes with the aesthetic of the bathroom because we have dark colors going on here. As you can see, we have the dark, um, well, black um, mats. So it just goes with the vibes. Ah, I love it. So we just have the shampoo and then we have the body wash. So simple, so sleek. I love it. All right, so now I'm in the guest bathroom. So I have an extra bottle. So I figured that I'll use this one in here. So currently we just have this um, stuff. I got this from Home Goods. So I'm about to go ahead and switch that out. <laughs> of this bathroom as well so yeah the bathroom is so cute this is a guest bathroom but this is also jace's bathroom so that's why we have the navy blue going on in here it's an extension of his bedroom because his bedroom theme bedroom theme is all blue so we figured instead of making it look kiddish because this is also the guest bathroom we decided to make it a little mature you know add the artwork some greenery you know so that it's presentable and it looks decent for when guests comes, because I don't want guests coming in and it looks like a kid's bathroom, you know? But yeah. So since I do have some leftover labels, I decided I'm just going to go ahead and switch out the labels on the dispensers in the kitchen as well. So these are what the labels look like currently. And then I'm going to go ahead and add on the same ones I did in the bathrooms. <laughs> coasters um i had ordered some coasters about a month or two ago but um they were way too flimsy so i decided to get some stone i think these are yeah stone um coasters i'm about to show y'all in a second so i got these um coasters from amazon so they're just like a stone they have feet on the bottom <laughs> so these are nice they came in a set of five so the closest that we had before were these um marble leather i showed you guys these before in a previous vlog but they were just way too light they're really flimsy and when you put your like say if you put your um tea or something hot on this your cup will stick to the bottom of this and I don't know I didn't like that so I decided to get some sturdier ones these are stone really nice and they have the bottom feet so it doesn't you know scrape up your table your coffee table next I think this is so I think this is um a booster seat I bought Jace a little booster seat for the dining chair so you can sit at the table he has a high chair um you can see the high chair behind me but i wanted to get him a booster seat so he can sit like a big boy <laughs> Okay, you guys, so it's another day. It's actually several days later. You guys, I did a thing. I did a thing. I did a thing that I always do. I'm going to show you what I did. So as you guys can see, I got rid of the 
black accent chair that used to be here so that is gone i know i know i know i know i know now you're like every other video i am returning an accent chair and getting a new one which is true so we're on our third i think our third or fourth no we're on our fourth um accent chair so i returned the first target chair then i returned the um ikea chair and then there was a chair that I bought that I didn't even show you guys. I got from Home Depot. I'll insert a picture of what it looks like. And I didn't like that one either. And now, dun, 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 let me show you guys the most recent um, accent chair that I got. Before I show you this chair, I just wanted to say that I was really hesitant on buying this chair. Not because I didn't like it, but because everybody and their mom had this chair. And I didn't want to have the same furniture as I didn't want to have the same furniture as everybody else. So I was like, eh. So I tried to I tried to um, find other chairs instead, but I ended up not liking the chairs as y'all can see. So, so I ended up getting this one and I actually really love it. I should have just got it from the beginning. But anyways, let me show you. So I'm sure you guys are familiar with this chair from Target. It's the Vernon upholstered chair, something like that. I think that's the name of it. But everybody has this chair, but I love it so much. I feel like I finally found my chair, y'all. It's a keeper. It's going to... I also think it meshes well with our sectional. I mean, I know they're not the same fabrics or anything like that, but it blends well together. So the chair that we got is... Um, the fabric is natural linen. So... Yeah, yeah. So yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and try to get a second one um, whenever they come back in stock because it's hard to get these shoes. They're always out of stock. So I was lucky on getting this one right here. So I'm gonna keep looking. I think I, did I sign up for the notification alert? I think I did. I gotta double check that, but whenever they restock, um, I'm gonna try to get my hands on a second one. And I also think I found a rug that I like. I haven't ordered it yet because I'm I'm just thinking about it, but I think I got my eyes on a rug that will tie in this room together. So hopefully y'all, cause I'm tired of returning stuff. <laughs> so yeah. Ooh, and it's actually really comfortable and it's really spacious. Yeah. So I'm definitely gonna get another one. And my little knot ball actually goes pretty well with it, giving it a little of a monochromatic moment. So I love that. So here's what the living room is looking like now, you guys. I feel like I'm taking forever to um, complete this space, but I'm just so indecisive. I can never make up my mind. I get one thing, don't want it. Get another thing, don't want that. So just bear with me, you guys. Just bear with me. We're going to get there eventually. So I appreciate you if you guys are still watching and enjoying the home updates. I really, really appreciate it. So sorry about the lighting down here. Um, we don't get direct sunlight in this room, so it's always kind of like a dull lighting. So this is what we got to work with. So in the dining area, um, I used to have a vase. Let me actually show you. So I had this vase um, as a centerpiece in the dining table, but I wanted to see what it would look like with the bowl. I'm actually, well, I actually ordered some green moss, I think, or green rocks, something like that. I ordered on Amazon, it was supposed to come today. So hopefully it comes today or tomorrow. Um, and then I'll show you guys what the centerpiece looks like. Cause I actually wanna add more greenery in here. I feel like I don't have enough greenery. I have, um, the tree in the living room you guys know but other than that there's like no greenery in this house so yeah i'm gonna show you guys what that looks like when it comes in you guys i'm actually so freaking obsessed with this chair why did i get this in the first place i was being so stubborn i should have just got it and now i can't get a second one y'all look at this wow All right, so we just got the moss. I'm gonna show you guys what it looks like now. All right, so here's the moss. Let me open it up real quick.
here is what the moss rocks look like. Do you think that's enough? Do I need another pack? Because the bowl is not completely full. There's a little bit of room at the top. But um, that'll do for now, I think. What do you guys think? Actually, our fruit bowl, I usually keep it over there. Um, but I want to try something different. So tell me what you guys think. Do you like the greenery on the table or not? Bring some life to the dining area. Yeah, I think I like that. So let me know what you guys think down below. All right. All right, you guys, so that is the end of this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope you guys subscribe. I hope you guys like, comment, do all that good stuff. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye. Thank you.